welcome, 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 welcome. Good morning, good morning. So listen, I'm gonna do a really quick roll up, okay? I just did the um all zodiac and I know it's now until you know Venus, but it's it's really what you're gonna be dealing with, okay? Um but I'm gonna do something real quick for you guys. Alright, so we're gonna start with water signs. Um wanna actually start with earth signs, sorry. <clears throat> Um, no, we're not, we're going to start with water. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness gracious. So, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces in that order, okay? So, let's find out what's going on my Cancerians. Cancer, Cancer. Whoa. All right. We have the Two of Pence, the Seven of Chalices, and the Three of Pence. Somebody's a little apprehensive. Somebody has a little bit of fear stepping into something. Um, I, to me, this isn't, it, it's confusion with the Seven of Cups here. It's, it's confusion whether or not to take it slow, whether or not to take it on, you know, whether or not to, with the Three of Pence come you know, come together and, you know, is, will this be, to me, this talks about, you know, stability, um, whether or not to come together and work with somebody when it comes to something. Cancer, cancer. Sticky. So, I feel like right now you're you're dealing with a lot. Okay, you got a lot going on. You're juggling. I, I don't think you're juggling different people, but you're juggling. Okay. Um. And we got the three of wands. So. It's really like, there's, you know, the wait will be over whenever it comes to something. You know, this would be like a romantic partner, but like, like the wait's over, but what are we going to do? Okay. Um, this talks about your future, you know, future stability, fear, you know, will this be something solid? confusion. Do I take it on? Do I not take it on? So this really talks about with whomever is in your life right now or whomever is coming into your life right now. It's do you want to do it? Do you not want to do it? Okay, we got the magician here and you can absolutely do it. You know, um, tell me about the magician. Just because I got these threes, but I'm not worried about these threes. I'd see multiple people. All right, it's it's the wheel with the ten of chalices. This person, you're deciding whether or not you want to put the effort in to make this work. Okay, could there have been a third person? Because we have three people in this wheel, yeah. Or this is, you guys stepped into something with this particular person, and it was already like that. Um, but with the ten of chalices here, with the magician in the wheel, this is something that went down the way it was supposed to go down, and as of right now, it's going down the way it's supposed to go down. But you're fearing it. You don't know what to do. Um, you're just... I don't really see fear like that. It's more apprehension, more apprehension than anything. And I don't think the confusion is going to be that, that heavy. But it's just like, do we want to build something? Do we not want to build something? Um, but you've learned a lot of lessons, regardless whether it was with this person, was it not with this person. Um, Got some cards messed up in this deck. So, um, you know, yeah, see, trying to decide, you, cause you're juggling a lot, and you're like, is it is it worth one more fight type thing to you? You know, do I do I put the effort in one last time? Um, 
it is kind of what it is. I don't know if you're dealing with air, but I don't know if you plan on sitting down with this person trying to figure it out. Tell me about the seven of chalices. That's too many, but it's only three. All right, again, King of Swords, your confusion lies whether or not to be with this type of particular person or, you know, having a conversation with this person. But we also have the death card, so I don't know if you're dealing with a strong Cappy too. But to me, this is not Cappy, um, Scorpio, but this is me. This is saying, you know, this is... This is a rebirth, and yeah, outcome is the sun. It's not speaking about a lion. I mean, not a lion, a Leo, okay, or an Aries. But if we're going to go there, you have every sign here except for Pence. All right, but I did say happy. But to me, this is saying you're confused whether or not did this person really go through a transition, and will I get the clarity I need? To me, this is saying this is going to grow, okay, because this keeps coming up for you guys. Regardless of what you're going through right now, this is saying it's going to get better. All right. Tell me about the sun. So you're going to have a decision to make. And I don't know, the sun, please, how you feel about making this decision. Because to me, I feel like you definitely know this person. Okay. I just saw the eight of cups and temperance. So you're definitely going to have to heal from this. There's temperance again. Okay. With the page. Somebody wants to come in an apology apologize so I don't know if you're gonna accept this apology or not um or this is like let's have a brand new start okay this is something new it's a new opportunity type thing and they're coming at you so and like I said this is this is healing too this is growth whatever it is you're going through you know just give it some time you're gonna make the right decision okay so that's that's basically why where my concerns at is you know do I have this new start with this person or do I give this person a new shot? You know, like that's where you're torn. You've definitely gone through a lot because with the magician in the wheel here, you've learned some very karmic lessons. But at the end of the day too, it's saying you can have your 10 of cups again. Okay. So, you know, go within, look for your own answers, talk with this person. You know, don't don't get your answers from other people. That's not where you're going to find these type of answers, okay? This has to do with you and this particular person, all right? So that was my cancer. Let's do our Scorpios. Let's do my Scorps. I don't know what that was. Don't even ask. Don't even ask what that was. All right. Scorpios. Scorpios. What are they up to? All right. Ten of Pence. This is somebody putting effort into something. This is the moon okay um to me something that went down between you and this particular person in the past did not really work out i can see it clear as day all right yep look at that see look at that clear as day look at those multiple women um i to just turn that down a second so this is somebody that now wants to come in and put the effort in it, it's still going towards the unknown there's still multiple people right here okay um and like I said, this here's the deal with this Hierophant. Regardless of what, whether they're with somebody else or not, I mean, not a good scenario, obviously. But this particular person knows exactly who who's in their heart, okay? Pleasure, love, okay? Big difference between pleasure and love. You know, what is this? A seven of Swords, okay? And it's like, there was definitely some deception here. Um, and now... It's like, how do you, how do you be intimate with this person after this? So I don't know if you're going to find out if something was exposed. 
Okay. I, I think to me, this sitting next to the moon, this is going to be exposed. You know, the moon can be hidden secrets. It can be, tell me about the moon. It can be illusion. It can be, to me, it's just, it, it, it's something hidden, whether it's the unknown in your future, whether it was another person. Tell me about the moon. Um, I will tell you though, the person you're dealing with looks like you were not the only person at one time. And I'm not saying this is now, because now they want to put the attention towards you with this Ten of Pens. Alright, so we have Three of Pens. Yeah, this person wants to come in and work together with you now. It's just the two of you, okay? Um, they they seriously want to put the effort in. and But I think you're going to find out about somebody you were unaware of. And if you did know about it, um, it's going to be real hard for you to get back together with this particular person. Okay, because of the, what you hear. So we're a little torn on what direction we're going to go right here. That is for sure. Um, what else? We have the star. To me, this is healing. This is, you know... It's also destiny, but it's it's also healing from from all of this, and its back is turned towards all the past, and it's it's looking down towards the future. Okay, um, so it to me this star already speaks of destiny because she's not holding two cups; she's got one. It's like you guys already blended the energy together. It's been blended, so. I guess the bottom line is, can you work with this person from the ground up, okay? Because whether you know about this third person or not, you're about to, okay? Um, so you're going to hesitate, too. Got the tool, the, the fear card there. You're going to hesitate going into this, too. You could be dealing with an Aquarian, but I just, I don't see that card that way. Um, yeah, see, look, the Empress, uh, I don't know, the truth came out, so... Um, and, and not to mention just splitting the deck at the Empress to get the chariot, got the higher font right there. We got destiny, got the 10 of pence. This looks like something that was destined to go down up until now anyway. Okay. Um, lots of major arcana in this read. I'll tell you that. So something's being divinely worked at. Um, tell me about this higher font. Higher font, higher font. All right, this King of Wands and the Hermit. All right, so this person has not taken action yet. This person is 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 still in the midst of you know soul searching, um. But th it's like they know, okay? They're coming out of Hermit mode. This action will be taken. The only thing that was upright was this Nine of Swords. So this is straight up warring, okay? Um, so it looks like this person coming towards you is worried. All right, this person has anxiety. This person doesn't know what to say or how to tell this story. Tell me about the moon, which would make sense because there's there's definitely multiple people here. And, you know, are we able to be, to me, this is, can we be intimate after you hear this news? Okay. Um, and, and this was reversed too, but I'm admitting these up right right now. Okay. But I, I will tell you that you've been being lied to and you're about to get the truth. Okay. Um. And that was with the moon. So the truth is coming out. It, it, like I said, it's something that you're not aware of yet. But this person still wants to come in and offer something stable. And you're still ending with the star. It, shit was just supposed to go down the way it, it went down, okay? So tell me about the star. Um, you know, you're going to have to make a decision when it comes to this person, all right? The four of wands, you're going to have to heal. Obviously, it, what you hear is going to cause sorrow. Because after the three is the, um, look at, see, five of cups. It's going to cause sorrow. And, you know, it's it's tough. It's, it's definitely a tough scenario that you're in right now, okay? The truth is going to be exposed about something. And, and that's that, all right?
whether you knew about this person or not, or if you did know, you know, there's, there's still something unknown to you, to you. It's just clear as day on my board. And regardless of the situation, it looks like if you want to make it work, you can, but that's on you and nobody else. Okay. <clears throat> so let's do Pisces. Let's do my fishies. Saw that hangman twice already. Oh, I didn't like that shuffle. Just do not want to cut, man. I'll tell you that. Funky, 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 funky. Pisces, Pisces. Finchies, my Finchies. Yep. Hierophant. Okay. Um, looks like there's definitely multiple people in this picture. Again, you know who you want to choose. And there's that hangman again. All right. So... But you, ha you have to make sacrifices. So to me, this is saying, even if there's not somebody else in the picture, here's the deal. Even if there's not somebody else in the picture, because here's the Ace of Pence. The deal is, you or this person you're dealing with likes to date, likes to play, likes to have options, okay? Doesn't like to be settled, okay? Um, doesn't want to be in a commitment type thing. You, you like your, sh your social status type situation, okay? And the universe is saying, you know, you, you got to pick and choose and, and have this new stack because we're giving you a new opportunity. But it looks like you choose because in all reality, you're in bed with somebody. You chose somebody, okay? So it looks like this might be a tough situation for my Pisces because I think they met somebody that they really like or somebody gave somebody an option here, okay? What, uh, not like an option, like an um, ultimatum. Okay, and my Pisces now have to sacrifice or vice versa. All right, the two of swords. So, again, decision, decisions, okay. Um, this is making a promise to somebody. So, you definitely chose somebody, like I said. All right, and now we got the four of wands, and apparently this person you know, you believe can offer you stability. You can have something solid with this person. So that's beautiful. All right. Um, looks like you got love here. For the queen of pence. Well, that's just somebody who's nurturing, somebody who's already stable. Somebody's got their shit together. Um, now I got the queen of swords too. So it looks like you got to cut something out. Looks like you might have feelings for two people. But you need to make a decision again. You got to cut something out. All right. I don't know if you were already married. And you got to let that go. It's definitely something. Tell me about the Hierophant. All right. Yeah, the Nine of Pens. You're not single. Okay. Um, it's, it's reverse. If I don't want to read these reverse. But what this would be saying is. You either, you don't want to be that person anymore, you, you don't want to be single, you want to be in something stable, okay, so this can go either way. It's either you're not single, or you're just, you're looking for that one particular person. You, you don't want to be this person anymore. Tell me about the hangman. All right, ace of pence again. But it was reversed, so it's, it's do I do it, do I not? It, it's, it, this is a big decision right here. You know this person can give you stability though. All right. And it looks like you definitely chose it. Looks like you definitely chose it. Tell me about this ace of pence. Ace of pence. Here we go. There's our Queen of Pence. Okay. Look at that. They always come out. So 
to me, you know, this is a lot of stability. All right. Or you're choosing right here, too, because they know I don't want to read them a verse. You're choosing somebody who's stable, somebody who's independent, somebody who has their shit together, somebody knows what they want, somebody who's solid. OK, so like I said, if you're a cross watch or anything like that, I don't I don't know for sure if there's multiple people. I mean, I, I will tell you, I think this person just likes to play and date. And I think they, you know, somebody possibly met their match and they're considering stepping in and, and moving towards this. Um. It looks like my Pisces are about to go make a promise to somebody, or vice versa. All right, yeah, see the Wheel of Fortune at the bottom of the deck. Everything went down the way it was supposed to go down. There's uh, Ace of Wands, all right? Um, <clears throat> so it looks like this Hierophant, whoever it is you're dealing with, is, is going to come in and make a promise. Tell me about the Two of Swords. You know, obviously, it's a decision needs to be made, but let's see where where it is you're wavering. It's just, you know, the strength, but it's already here. You have the strength to go towards it. So go towards your stability. Go express to this person how it is you feel, all right? Because you're dealing with somebody who's very solid, very stable, very independent, very nurturing, very grounded, possibly has their own business. Definitely knows how to provide, okay? So, there's that. I love you guys. Have a fantastic day, okay? Bye.